Reach oh, it turn. stays. The dance your, your, your lights stay there. Good, up to four minutes. Lovely. All right. Well, I'm going to drop my... Or, well, I'm going to stole my crossbow, pull out my mace, step forward, and tack this sucker. And please get a good roll. Oh, brother. I rolled a two. Uh, this is not good. Two plus... It's always, four, it's always the last kobold total. we can't kill. Well, it's not even a kobold. But you take your swing, not noticing the wall is right next to you, and you hit the wall. Take that wall. Yeah, it was actually four total, but yeah. Oh, my bad. Same result. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> There's a wall there. What's next? Well, Edgren and Kimmy just kind of are just kind of waltzing up, trying mm. to see what's going on. And Jocko, it's your turn. Excellent. All right. Taking a shot, uh, the one that's in front of me. Between the orc's legs? I can shoot around him. He's not five feet wide. Yeah, like I know there are, there are minuses, but Sheldon will take that into account. Okay. Uh, 24. Okay, roll for damage. Finally! Yay! You guys haven't even hit this one. Nope, Just this is, saying. Uh, five. This one has a dead kobold on top of it, which is kind of funny. Five is the damage. <laughs> they both got dead kobolds on top of them. <laughs> One's got a dead slurk underneath it. Bye, Ron. I like okay. you. All right, you. Five. Five was the damage. So you, you, what you do is you kind of duck down and shoot between the <laughs> legs of Reach. Yes. Oh, that yes. works. <gasps> Oh. And <laughs> call that. Well, they're they're there, doing so, might I add? And you yeah. you get it close to its eye. Nice. I swear, Halfley, you shoot me in the butt again. <laughs> Maybe it's your turn. Don't you worry, I'm taking feats. All right. Um, <laughs> can you guys see the way that I move the my character when I move it? When you move like, your character, it will come. It will come ping, up. Ping like if I first. do this. Did you guys see that movement path, or is yes, it yes. just... Yes. Okay. That's the movement path I took to flank this guy, if that's a flank. That moves you through... All right, that it's moves you... Th an attack of opportunity. That's an attack of opportunity. And you, you moved it. your token. Oh, boy. Take before you move. How is that an attack of opportunity if I flanked him? This right you... here is a threatened square. You have to move through the square, which I might add, you had to crawl over the top of a slur. I didn't. Slur. I went through the seven. I didn't go through that square. Yeah. I went that what way. Oh, walked around. I walked around. This is a threatened square. Oh, oh, I see. So All bad. right. I'll but this give is you, still a threatened square. Uh, no. All right. So, Technically Mandy, not, when I you do this so next confused. time, take control of your character. Click on your character. Just click okay. the arrow keys to move the individual squares around. Because all I saw is that you just jumped right through. Oh. Yeah, see, that's that's what I wanted to know, is if you guys no. could see that. Yeah, for example... No, it's just like, it, yeah, If it I moved, moved it that it way. Moved straight there. Okay. If I can do a demonstration, this is not me moving my character, Sheldon. This is just a demonstration. Okay. I'm going to move my character in curly cues all the way up into the map. What did it look like to you guys? Straight slide. Straight, straight, straight yeah. slide through. Curly cue back down. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. If you if you either Sorry, I missed that you can either draw it you can either draw it on the map or you can just uh, use the keys the arrow keys to kind like of this. walk your way oh, through. Oh, now I see it. Okay. Yes. I'm sorry I wasn't on when I saw that when you guys went over that. <laughs> well, we didn't actually, but that's how that works. So now that you get, like this that. is the first time that you guys are controlling your characters, so. But okay. you still move through this square, which is yeah. also threatened, which is an okay. attack of opportunity. Okay. How much? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's got to hit you first. Oh boy. It hit, well, it did. It, well, I had already rolled that when she started oh. asking through the confusion. Lovely. Yeah. Take four hit points of damage as it bites down into your side. Ouch. I hope you're not dead. Please don't be you dead. Lost blaze beard. Where do you go? Jonathan, no. where'd you go? His computer okay. restarted. 
<laughs> He'll be back as uh, soon as he can. Well, all right. Well, well in the meantime. This... <laughs> all right, all right. So the can slurk. I finish my turn. <laughs> yes, it's your turn. Finish this. I want to this attack turn. it. It's Jonathan, come in here. Natural twenty. It wasn't next month, guys. <laughs> it wasn't next month. All right. So, ro roll to confirm the crit first of all. Confirm. If I don't drop the die. Twelve. Twelve. Twelve plus. Well, what's your plus bonus? plus plus your bonus? Oh, plus my bonus is uh sixteen. Okay. All right. Yes. You do get your double da your bonus. You get your full yes. double damage. You get your crit damage. All right. Three so dice. Let's see or... with that. It's just okay. Yeah, it's double. And add your strength twice. My strength modifier. Yeah. So you know you do the whole adding. You know, you add everything, all the rolls and the the modifier twice. We know you killed this thing. So 2d6 plus your modifier plus 2d6 plus your modifier. Plus your modifier. So 4d6 plus your modifier twice. Yep. 13? Yeah, that's what I thought. Good hit. Can I... What do I do to this one? Describe one. it for us. What, what, how would you Describe do it? this as your... Yeah. Please how, use the words is your attack? Blow. <laughs> well... Usually when I do things like this, you always are like, I raise my mighty sword, and I bring it down, and usually I cut it in half. <laughs> you don't cut it in half. I didn't think so this time, but so it's you just like, chop like an arm off or something. But it, it had turned to, atta to attack you, so it, you were attacking its face, and you, act you get it, you bury your, head, your blade in its head, Sweet. and then pull it out. Pull out brain goo. Yeah, pretty much. So I'm it gonna does clean go it down. off on Blazebeard when he gets back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he'll love it. Do you have that slime in your hair? <laughs> it was a natural twenty, so I imagine I did it flawlessly. So no. But when you when you fell and got up, is that kind of oh, mm, yeah, That's probably in my hair. Yeah. <laughs> Are we going to take the five minute break then? <laughs> yeah, so we just finished that fight and we will take a quick break. So We're going to get Blazebeard back. So. We, yeah, we've got to get Blazebeard back for one. So Retail we'll be back the in. Slimy hair and nods approvingly. <laughs> <laughs> so we will be back hopefully within the next five minutes. Stay tuned.
we are back. All right. So, what are you guys doing? Um. Oi. <laughs> <laughs> I am. You guys just you. you just took out the slurks. You're well, in this room that is full with slurk gunk. Maybe. And as you as you as you step into the room, since you just moved, Retol, please roll your acrobatics. your your dexterity acrobatics. <laughs> uh, what are you I'm falling and pale yourself. Ac- acrobatics. Uh. Yeah, that's what I'm doing for balance. Uh, well, I rolled twenty. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm just seeing. I'm just, I just want to see who gets covered in crap. Look, I've got a really I, high acrobatics check, so I hand Maeve a healing potion since she just got her sides like bleeding. Yes. I kind of really need that. Kind of. <laughs> I'm actually a little more get than kind God of. On. All right, so I'm gonna drink that. How much do I get back for it? Six, Six. hit points. Six. I'm going to say to Blazebeard and tell him to go tell Edgrin and the kids, Oi, this room's full of slime. I don't know if we want everyone trekking through here. Well, we either continue this way or go through the ambush. Edgrin, not- kids, the room's full of slime. You might not want to trek in there. That's what the halfling said. That's all. There's Get no the slime up here. <laughs> Someone go get the tell the kobolds to come up also, here. Also, go tell them to get the kobolds up here. I mean, wait, none of us be kobold. Uh, get, Maeve? get the elf. Maeve. Okay. Um, where are the kobolds? Are they still back in that room? Yeah, yeah they're way they're down. down to the south. Okay, so I will go down there, I guess. Get them um, and ask them once they get here which way they think we should go. Right Reloading my crossbow. And also, can we ask? Can we get uh, out of the room? Just, 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 you know, we'll just, we won't, don't have to even move all the tokens around per se. Just go, you go down there, and what do you say? Hey guys, we need you up here. Uh, we're the father. We're the cattle. Uh, our cattle boss. I'll come back. Yes, <laughs> 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 master. <laughs> Every time the giant group moves, it startles me. Like, ah! <laughs> Cold right, you just got ambushed. <laughs> Can we see Sheldon up in this corner? Like, yes. Is, is this a dead end or is this a passageway up there? So let me just measure out as far as how much light you got. Okay. So you looking down that northern corridor, you are able to see that it does extend a bit and then branches off in a few different directions. And these right here... Are steps? Come on, come on. Why is it not pinging? Those? Yes. Those are stair steps that just kind of lead down. Oh, the D is for down. <laughs> yes, indeed. I'll move there. Can I see anything here? Is this a dead end? Yeah, you don't see very far. Dark vision. But oh, okay, gotcha. Because you're looking around a corner. Good job, Nick. We're way from here. Uh, what's the safest path? <laughs> yeah, what's the uh, safest path? Ask, ask him which way from the crossroads, yeah. The, on the other side of the path, it... it uh, where where we sleep at at home. Uh, to 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 the east. Oh, don't go down! Don't go down that way. You'll die to death. Ah, what's down that way? Ah, the the dark beast, the darky dark. Only death below. Our old home. We lost it. Uh, so, to get Where to the kids? kids, do we travel west? No, or er, right, right. <sighs> um, 
Need a drink, It'd Sheldon? Easier to rest, show us. Rest. The the shriekers. Shriek. The sh the shriekers. We know, we don't we never use that path. Which uh, ask him which way to the kid. I don't understand all this jibber jabber. So <laughs> we continue north to get to the kids. There, uh, it it everybody there. You have to go through there to us. Everybody there, though. Oh, right. Boy. So, guys. What, what did he say? He says, uh, to the north oh. is... That. Well, that no, that. that's that's nothing. <laughs> oh. uh, so, to the, the north is away. where... You're in the wall. <laughs> yeah, I hide things in the wall when, I, when they move. <laughs> <laughs> so, to the north is where all of them are going to be, sleeping and hanging out to the... East, there is darkness, a big pit, they said. They used to be their home, but they lost it. And to the west is where the Shriekers are. Shriekers, And eh? death will follow us to the east and to the west. Ask him what the safest path to the kids, the kid is. What is the safest path? Uh, it, it north. It... Both path, both paths lead north, and but it there are going so many, so many kobolds, the whole tribe. I point to uh, this one down here, and say, "Where does this one go?" Ah, uh, that one go back and to west. Uh, egg catchy. Egg catchy. I look, I look at Maeve and you say, don't, "You don't understand that." <laughs> Maybe oh, that's, I heard, a, uh, that's why I asked egg catchy. I just would what like to point mean? out Kajemic didn't understand what Brayden asked either. Well, I pointed I pointed that way and looked at me <laughs> and said, What about this way? Can we just have assumed translation going on here? <laughs> I suppose we can. Just just to make life easier. Good. Do we want to do that or do you want me to keep relating? We do, we'll do assumed translation. But Yay! Okay. No more Uhura. Oh, well, for just this conversation, at least. <laughs> okay, I ask oh. what's over here where I'm pinging. Like, that, 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 if we can get to the kids that way. It, 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 don't, it winds around, and don't, it come back, or egg hatchy. What does egg hatchy mean? Egg hatchy? Egg hatchy! <laughs> Guys, Say it it's again. where <laughs> they hatch. <laughs> guys, guys, guys! It's where they hatch their eggs. It's the egg hatchery. Oh, egg hatchery! <laughs> egg oh, hatchery. Uh, <laughs> I vote this way, so we're not going through all the kobolds, and then wrap around, and hopefully, we don't have to go through their barracks. Hey, Sheldon, that's, here's an acrobatics my... check for me moving through sludge. Okay. Uh, twenty. All right, you don't trip on your sure-footed <laughs> halfling feet. Yay. I'm going to roll also. A six! All right, well, <gasps> you walk through, and you slip and fall on your face, and you roll around a little bit in the slime. Oh, good. Now you smell bad. Ugh. He's always smelt bad. Uh, <laughs> now he's two close. different kinds of smelling bad. <laughs> no, no. no smell quite well. I've got a good nose. Oh. Right. Okay. Yes. Let's do what Rito said because we should listen to him. He's been <laughs> hey. honest about that. And let's go down the egg hatchy way. And not the way that's filled with kobolds, shriekers, or certain death. What say, everyone? Can I'll go with it. Can someone with light come over here so I can see where I'm going? Hey, oh. before we do that, um, it's like midnight something. Yeah. I was just wondering if this might be a good chance to, to pause after this battle till the next. It's only um, 11.20. Uh, your place. Jonathan does have to work tomorrow. Um, 
I'm fine to keep going. Are you saying you want to stop, Jonathan? Well, I'm just, I was wondering for everyone, what is it here? 11, 20, it's 12, 18 here. 11, 18, okay. where those two are. I can go for 15 more minutes if people want to do it. And then I should go to bed. I don't want to, I don't want to. You can well. Things, you guys can at least kind of a make a decision positive. on what you want to take a look at, and you know we if can, there's a fight, we can pa We may have we, to have a cliffhanger before this okay. kind of thing. Well, I think uh, we want to all make our way down this way and see what we see. Yes. So some. No, let's let the kobolds go first. I'll be right behind them. You're, so traps. you're going to the southwest then? Yes. Yeah. yeah. By the way, I'm standing right there, and I have dark vision, and so I can look down that corridor. I'm going to do perception roll, even though I can't see very far, just to see what I can see. Eh. Ah! So, Sheldon, I I can see 60 feet down this thing. 14 on the perception roll. With my dark vision. What do I see? Well, it, it curves. The cavern... Is this as far as I can see, just right here? What the... <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> there you go. Okay. King's log. You I got a 14 see... on my acrobatics. All right, you don't trip. Good. Um, Sounds so, good. Oh, there actually. we go. Oh, so also, Edgrid, this is what we're doing. We're going down this, this passage this way. That was quite the loop around from that mm -hmm. ambush. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a good uh, thing we didn't fight those two kobolds so that we could fight three other kobolds and two slurks. Congratulations. Much. And one Apparently incredible stacked this... chicken-legged one. <laughs> this is why we listen to me. <laughs> uh, All right. Let's go this way, guys. Quietly. Can quietly, I see anything down I... the hallway? Hold on. Stealth roll for quietly for me is 25. All right. Well, you you are now jumping out in front of everybody. Perception check, by the way. Uh, for trap finding and otherwise. For trap finding, I guess it would be 23. Otherwise, it would be 22. 23. Also, I think we want those kobolds out front. All right, you're sending the kobolds out in front. Well. Ooh. Well, what? Or not? I didn't say that. Go ahead. No, go ahead. I didn't put it. Well, I, I just was wondering what we could see. Out front, like, I, if there's something there. Or not. Well, I'll give you vision. I want to see you over here. So you can see from this angle that. I'd right. cast touch resistance on everyone. Thank you. And guidance on everyone. And uh, those kobolds are still are out in front of us, right? I think we should only have like two or three of them out in front of us, and then the rest in the back. Yeah. Well, there we go. Three are in the front, three in the back. Scream if you're killed. All right, well, three <laughs> kobolds walk out, and they don't die. Oh, good. Do, 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 do. All right, I've got to check something. Or what is it you're rolling? I uh, was stealth roll. I was a twenty-one. Okay. And are you also rolling perception? I will do that too. Uh, uh twenty-six for trap finding, twenty-five for otherwise. Twenty-six. No traps, or traps. Ooh. Well. I'm trying to figure out how best to... You don't find it? You do not run into any traps. Okay. Oh, do I see any... From do this I see angle, any... let's see, the light is traveling 60 feet, so that would mean... Also, you see my arrows I'm drawing? Yes. What about them? Uh, aren't these kobolds supposed to be following us? You said that you want three to go. Oh, and three, three to take up the rear. Three behind. And what about uh, the the halfling dude and the bard and the kids and everything? I did go back and tell them what was going on. Right, but they did you tell them to follow the us? kobolds? 
I just told him what was going on. He makes his own decisions. Uh, and right, so, as far on. as what you can, what I'm going to show, a light is shining here. That angle, I'm. I, I just have a question. Yes. So, are we leaving the kids standing in the dark now? Oh, Edgren's with them. I assume they followed after us. He's what, they can was, sit in the what, muck room and play in well, the muck. Well, since nobody said anything, they're just going to follow you, and then, and they're so they're back in that room. They're not just staying in the darkness, but you guys are kind of <laughs> leaving them without a light source. I did tell Edgrin about what was going on, so it's not like they're in the dark intellectually. <laughs> but in the dark, <laughs> Edgrin doesn't have anything. Ed, yeah, Edgrin doesn't have any light come source. With us. Yeah. Well, again, it's tight cor it's tight corridors, and they're they're following as best they can. Our right. small army. <laughs> yeah. Well, so, it's best that they take the hits because we I can't take many more. So, you do see at the end of this hallway a hand. Come on, reveal that stupid thing. There, there is a, another kobold that is down at the end of the corridor on top of a slurk and I'm hanging back <laughs> hand hand up I'm going to say oi there's you another one you did get a pretty good uh search check mm -hmm. and the light is enough that you can see that there is a kobold hiding down here oi guys there's a couple more kobolds I I know that's not surprising since that's like all we ever fight anymore um <laughs> But, just so you know, they're there. One of them's on a frog, a slurk, whatever that thing is. Just Maybe letting you know. Shoot. I so told you that frog was a slurk. So have they seen us yet? Can... Hold on, I'm looking at oh, arrows. I guess we're carrying light. Well, your light is shining into the room. If I can see them... But I've been sneaking. Um... Again, would see. you guys are carrying a light. The only way that you would be able to see them is if the light reached them. So well, they would right. look towards us and see kobolds first, probably, which might surprise them. Good. Then I'm shooting that one. Can I shoot that one? I'm I'm arrowing the, the corner there. Yes. All right. Shooting the slurk or the kobold? Cause I'm shooting there. the slurk. The kobold can get stuck on a dead slurk for all I care. <laughs> All right. Um, and it wasn't within 30 feet, so I don't get the plus one. But I do get a plus one from Guidance. Thank you. You're so that would be a 25. <laughs> You're welcome. Very short. All right, roll for damage. All right, since that was a sneak attack, here comes damage. Boom. 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 And eh, not as good. Seven. Okay, seven total damage, and that is that guy. Okay, your arrow hits the, you know, are you aiming for the kobold slurk. or the slurk he's on? Slurk, You're aiming for the said. slurk. Yes. So if we kill the slurk before the, they get over here, the kobold will be stuck in it and he can't do anything. And you got a five on your damage? Uh, seven on the damage. Seven. They throw spears. It throws spheres? They throw spears. Oh, spears. Well, that's true. The but others that we fought threw a lot of spears. Not the ones we killed in the slime room, but... Right. The, the ones from the at the bottom of the well. Yeah, that's true. All right. Well, you got its atten the guy's attention for sure this time. And he turns at you. And then he shouts something in Draconic. And That's our roll, in, roll initiative. All right. Or wait, do do we have time? We don't even have Jonathan, time for this. Do we have time? What time is it now? It's almost twelve thirty. It's twelve twenty-seven. We, should, we got time to roll initiative. <laughs> you want to roll initiative? Or do you want to save that till next time? Let's we can do roll this initiative one battle here and then call it. This battle yeah, here might take like a battle. Yeah. What? 
The battle might take like an hour. How long did it take That's you to true. take out two slurks? That's right. Let's, uh, yeah, let's just, uh, what do you guys think? I think call it because I got to work, I would say. And this is good. <laughs> right good. as we so, roll initiative. When we come back, we'll roll initiative. <laughs> <How's> that <laughs> sounds good. Let's do that. Yep. So, did we have a day for next time in mind? Um, I, I'm off Sunday, Monday, Tuesday nights for my nights next week. Sunday oh, in like short sessions. two days works for me. Yeah, that, that's right. So they've got to just be s shorter sessions. Right. So do we want to do Sunday then? Jonathan said that was best for him. What about the rest of you? That's fine. Yeah, as long it as works. we're yeah, done a little earlier. All right. So for everybody watching, we're leaving you on a cliffhanger right as the sneak attack has happened and initiative is next. Dun, dun, dun. Initiative! <laughs> so... I'll be posting the VODs on YouTube, as always, youtube.com slash progstormrising, and you can follow me here, and you can also follow me on Twitter, and I announce whenever we go live. Oh, and just a side note, don't Google search for uh, kobold, stacked kobold with chicken legs. It, you might not get <laughs> pleasant results. Just make sure safe searches on, you'll be fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> You'll probably only find our video, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope. Anyways, uh, oh, once once something I do want to mention is Jeff, your mute, the music that you wrote that's yes. going to be part of this show, actually. Yes. Go to youtube.com slash Mr. Mr. Kerr. Part of my 52 weeks of music project, the one I recently did, which is week 31, is a theme song for the show. We, I will shortly also have a like an actual video to go along with the song. I've done kind of a prototype of it, but I'm going to do one that's it's a work in progress. Right. So if, if you go there, you can listen to it. It's just this, you know, kind of fun sounding medieval Re Renaissance, medieval Renaiss type thing. Renaissance thing. Anyway, it's so. got a recorder. Ooh, hot cross buns. Anyway, so there's that. Did but, you have uh, experience ready for us, Sheldon? Did we want to do that? Well, okay, we somebody want to bust out a calculator real quick? Busted! By which I mean I'm clicking on the program. Got it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> Are the, got it. Not Are really the viewers ever. gone? No, we're still on, aren't we? We're still on the stream? Or are we... Oh, well, yeah, we're, so, we're, still, we're still live. So okay. I'm, let's see. So in this, we had the two slurks and the one kobold. So and we also we also had the and, stacked kobold. And this, yeah. And <laughs> and maybe some XP for the wacky blazebeard ghost thing. Kazan! I pulled a yeah, spear I'm, out of a toothy guy. <laughs> oh, and Ron didn't argue with you or make fun of you, so he gets, uh, he said he, he gets some extra XP for that. So, I wiped my sword off on Blaze Beard. Shh, let, let the GM talk. What do we got? So, I'm going to give. Alright, so Blaze Beard for scaring them off, and Jocko, or, well, Jocko fought the. Scaring, the, scaring them off, that's 300 XP. Ooh, oh. write it down. Got it. There's a lot of slaves we got for, out of there. For everyone or just for him? Just, just for him. Oh. And then... Start adding these up. Okay. Okay. 800. This will be divided by 6 at the end. Or 5. 1,200. And 600. And actually divide it by 4. Divide by 4. 650. All right. Everybody take 650. Okay. What about... Uh, didn't I crit that... Uh... Crits don't give you... No, crits... G but generally, didn't I... it's just going to be something, something just completely awesome happens at the, where I'll give like extra XP for that right. kind of thing. Well, I am gonna... that I scare him, I actually killed the guy, too. Hmm, I did say it earlier yeah. for for not being interruptive and everything. Boric gets an extra 150. Hey, Yay. I wasn't being interruptive, either. <laughs> Do I get any XP for looking hey, up that rule that we were I arguing over? I normally don't interrupt in any way, so... 
I was trying to save our dwarf. That's all. <laughs> From having uh, like negative take, 10 take 25 if you, for the rule. <laughs> Fine for helping me out. That's that's all I ask. I I, I didn't ask for anything. It's not, it's not much though, and that as yeah. you as you have begun leveling up, it's going to become exponentially smaller. How effective that is. I know. I know. But that if is we it get for experience XP. like this again, I level up next session. Yeah, does anybody else level up? Is it, yeah, does anybody here level up? Close, no cigar. Okay. Unless you want to give me 150 for the spiky tooth guy hand thing. That's true. <laughs> you did pull the spear out of the guy at the beginning. That doesn't oh. really count that yet, though. I could do with 362. I'll give you an extra <laughs> 50 for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For yeah, okay. Yeah, but I did yeah. murder. I did murder that uh, chicken leg thing in like one. Uh, That's what one the blow. 654 is for, dude. Yeah, okay. D dude, you got you got quite a got bit it. of XP on that one. All okay. right, so we're gonna be Plus doing the... this again on Sunday night. Sounds Sunday like Sunday night. So 8:30 at, is our normal time, I believe. Sounds Pacific good. and Pacific was our Pacific. Was our outlaw. Yeah. Was our outlawed group doing anything this week? Oh, we wait, are you are you guys good for tomorrow night? I'm good for tomorrow night. No. All right, Saturday night. Yes. Uh, yes, I'd be good for Saturday night. Okay. Okay. And Ron, you're you're also good for that. So Saturday night we will have, which is not not tomorrow not tomorrow night, but the night after we will have our other group, which is. Roll of the dice outlawed, which we've got a basically a rogue group going around thieving, trying to pull heists, and so that nice. is escaping the law heist. right now. Heist, <laughs> yeah. Last, uh, last I'm week we ended up uh, running a whole bunch. The thing is, I've fighting. been looking at, uh, I've been, I've been uh, reading Order of the Stick, and I just got caught up on everything. And <laughs> the thing is, it's got me like thinking about, okay, what is this stuff going on? Yeah, you guys, um, you, the. Th uh, for, foreshadowing things might start catching up with you eventually, eventually. Yeah, you, Yay, you, 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 you can't escape that high level of a priest and not expect that he's not going to be able to find you somehow Judas priest great <laughs> so all right that's hopefully we hope we've got a few levels on our on our uh, side by then <laughs> one can hope but anyways, uh, thank you all for watching, and we will see you next time. <laughs> How much XP for successfully seducing the kobold? The oh. stacked one. <laughs> That's Good night, everybody. Good night, Good night. everybody. <laughs>